Hey there guys, this is NDM here, bringing you another episode of Let's Play Super Mario Galaxy. Okay, so in the last episode, we did the first star in Toy Time Galaxy, and in this episode, we're going to do the second star in Toy Time, toy time Galaxy, not Toys Time Toy, whatever the hell I was trying to say, I don't know. But, uh, yeah, this star is Mario's, Ma no, Mario meets Mario. Okay, but if you play it on Luigi, it'll be Luigi meets Luigi, I think, or it'll be either Luigi meets Mario. I think it's Luigi w meets Luigi, so it is different in um, when you play it as Luigi. I think the planet is Luigi if you play it as Luigi, like the texture changes to Luigi. Because the Mario um, on the NES has the same kind of sprite as what the uh, Luigi did on the NES version of Super Mario Brothers. Well, the original Super Mario Brothers. All systems are go. Why? Because I say so. <laughs> okay, whatever you say. Whatever you say, mister. I think there are more, like, um, springy things that we got to use, like using the spring star, so... Yeah, gonna be more fun times ahead of us. Oh god, there's a laser! I'm a fire in my laser! I'm a fire in my taser! I'm a fire in my buttered sandwich... my butter sandwich with cheese! If that makes any sense doesn't because because sandwiches can't fire lasers I mean it'd be pr we'd be living in a pretty scary world if um, if sandwiches could shoot lasers sandwich of death sandwich of doom uh, as I say yeah it is we got ourselves another star chip so we're doing more star chip hunting I think how the heck am I gonna get that how the heck am I gonna get this that's way too high in the air, dude. There's no way I'm gonna get that unless I get the spring Mario, but I haven't seen the spring mushroom yet, so that's just gonna have to be um, solved out or figured out somehow. Right, I'm gonna crush this thing on the high, on the high jump if I can. No, I didn't get the chance to because he got on the spring at the wrong time. <laughs> he was supposed to get on it at the time when I was going to land down, not go up and then land down. Stupid thing. Oh, we're, we're unscrewing something. We did that? Is that how we get the star chip? Was that what we were supposed to do? Um, I think our problems have been solved. And this is the last star chip. So now we've got five. And we're right here where the launch star is. How convenient. <laughs> awesome. So that means we don't have to go to the other side of the planet or anything to get the... Uh, Oh, what? We're here already? Huh. Well, that's a surprise. I thought it took us ages to get to this place. Obviously not. And there's a bunch of hurry-scurry platforms here, so we got to really be careful. And these platforms move as well, so if you step on these, they'll move. So, yeah. Uh, be careful of, like, basically be careful of every single platform that you can get on on this planet. Because either way, it's going to end up killing you one way or another. But yeah, we're doing some silver star collecting. Not like the fake, fake power stars, but the silver stars that are going to make up for a power star, a gold power star. Yeah, that hopefully there'll be no more silver star collecting any of that crap. <laughs> right, have I done this correctly? Because I want to make it an easy route to get all the way back to the beginning, because that's where the star is going to spawn now. So you got to go all the way back to the other side of the planet. That's why I said you have to be very strategic on which platforms you use up. Because if you use up every single platform, you cannot make it back. It's virtually impossible. Right, so just long jump here. Well, that wasn't what I wanted to do, but okay. <laughs> uh, can I, I don't know if I can long jump there. That's crazy. Well, I can from here. If, yeah, quick, go. No, you didn't. Oh, damn it. I messed up on the last freaking platform. Are you serious? Oh well, I was... I, okay, what I want to do is don't use those platforms there. So just jump this, so then there are some platforms here for you when you get back. Alright, hopefully we do better this time, and I'm about to land in a fire. <laughs> I was close. Alright, just long jump. So then you don't use up so many platforms. That way you'll do okay. Right, now the last one is all the way back at the beginning, so that's fine. Are you serious? You didn't even jump. Oh my god. Dude. <laughs> but I've got the right idea. Just keep jumping. 
and then long jump like crazy, and then long jump again, uh, turn around, so, yeah, okay. Wait, no, 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 oh, great, the only way I'm going to get that is if I long jump, once. yeah, that's fine. No, don't fall in the lava, whatever you do. I'm telling you, this is not the last you'll be this is not the last you'll be seeing of this planet because you have to come back here later on and do a comet. And it's the hardest comet in the game. Seriously. You'll see when we get to it, but that's not gonna be for a while. Uh, from now, so you don't have to worry about that. <laughs> and I've gotta be very quick with my reflexes here. You know what I got? Yeah, right. Okay. Whew, we're on the home stretch. Yeah, we got the power star. <laughs> at last, at long last, we finally got it. And that leaves us with 45 power stars, which I think is enough to now to open the boss stage. Believe it or not. So yeah, we've already unlocked the boss stage of the engine room. How crazy is that? And we've only done two power stars inside the engine room. But I thought we would have had to backtrack and got more power stars to unlock these galaxies, but by the looks of things, we're unlocking these pretty easily. Like, you don't need a lot of power stars to open them. I think it's the final dome where you need plenty of power stars to unlock the galaxies. I think so, anyway, because it's like the last dome and stuff. So. Um, should we do another one? Yeah, what the hey, let's go ahead, jump straight on into this and see if we can. Uh, then we'll have Toy Time Galaxy completed and then we can go ahead and jump into another galaxy and get all the, get all the other three stars and lows. And then once we've done all these galaxies we can then go ahead and take on the boss. Oh, I thought my game froze this and I was like, what? It's just, it just stayed on, on the white screen for like a, a few seconds and I was worried. I was going to have a panic attack, I was going to be like, oh no, i got to reset my system, which means then I'm going to have to stop the recording. But no, none of that. Wow, don't fall off on the first friggin' planet, dude. Crazy, I almost jumped straight over that train. <laughs> if I did that, that would have sucked so bad. Alright, get the... Were those orange wedges, by any chance? Floating orange wedges? I wonder who was eating those. Well, orange is my favourite fruit. There's no better fruit than orange, and I hate strawberries, but strawberry... Wait, strawberry's a fruit? Yeah, it is. It's not a vegetable. And tomato is a is a fruit, not a vegetable. I was about to say it was a vegetable. And uh, banana is a herb, if any of you didn't know that. Yeah, people say banana's a fruit. It's not a fruit. It's actually a herb. And everything else is just veg. Well, everything else is what everyone thinks they are. Like you know, cabbage is obviously f a vegetable. And well, if we got to do this all the spring, Mario, damn, <laughs> I'm not very good with these controls. I can tell you that. So there's probably going to be a hell of a load of fail on this. If I managed to do this star without dying, I would be very, very surprised. Because I think all of this is done as spring, Mario, or the majority of it, anyway. Right, I can see the sling star, so as soon as we get in this, we should lose our spring Mario, yeah. Oh my god, what are we on? It's an ice cream cone! So this is ice cream, oh, why can't I just eat all this? I mean, I'm starving, I've been working way too hard here, and I think I deserve a little bit of a break, and just take the time to have something to eat. I am the hero, after all, I do deserve to eat, and I've just killed myself. Well, I didn't kill myself, I accidentally fell off the edge. <laughs> if that counts as killing yourself, then... Then I just killed myself. I'm a suicidal... while well, Mario's a suicidal maniac. I'm the one controlling you, but I'm not the one who makes the decisions for you. Well, technically I am, but still. <laughs> Where are we meant to go here? Oh, right, I see. We've got ice. Um, don't fall, though. <laughs> Oh, right, I remember this planet. Um, you can skate right across this if you really, really... If you have, like, the skills. But I don't have the skills and I don't want to take the risk and there's a fly in my face. Get out of here, fly. 
I'm gonna break my concentration, and now I'm gonna die again. Ah! Like it's always on the freaking second power star. I always mess up or something. It's just like ugh. It's just like ugh. Yeah, I. Ki How did I? Oh wait. Oh, <laughs> the gravity actually saved me then. Thank God. All right. Okay, I, I need to focus because I don't want to die and waste time or waste any more time. And it seems whenever I record, the applications just suddenly want to come sp spurting out of of the computer, and I'm oh god damn it! Oh, dude, I sounded like I was ejaculating just then, but still, that was such a good feeling that I didn't die. <laughs> Crap, crap, crap. Okay, uh, I want to try and take the risk of long jumping, so I am. Yeah, because I'm a badass. Right, hang on, let me get my Wii pointer on the screen. Ugh. Oh my god, seriously. I need to really... Yeah, you can, st you can stop there if you want and get a bunch of star bits, but... That's wasting time, and we don't have time to waste. I think there is um, a one-up life shroom around here somewhere. So if we go in straight into the warp pipe, oh no, this is a a rainbow Mario. Um, th oh, isn't it? Oh, I thought it was a rainbow Mario kind of thing, but obviously not. I don't know what this is going to do, but we're going to find out. Might give us a one-up. I guarantee it. Yeah, I thought as much. Well, then what's with all these spiky things? If you can't get rid of these, I don't see why you put them in here. I guess it's to throw you off when you're trying to collect all the notes, I guess. Trying to trick you out. Okay, I have no time for you. So don't even bother trying to spurt your fire at me. Because I am not in the mood. Alright, what you gotta do here is take out all the candles, so... Blow out the candles and make a wish. <laughs> Even though it's not my birthday. My birthday passed quite a while ago now. It could be Mario's birthday, so Mario, make a wish. Well, at least he finally got his cake in some way. <laughs> but it was a galaxy and he couldn't eat it because Mario's not that big and he can't consume so much cake, otherwise he'll end up throwing up his insides. And what's this guy do when he's shooting his electric balls at me? Ah, uh, right, okay, this boss battle is a bit of a pain in the ass. Because the only way you can hit him is by using <laughs> Spring Mario. Okay, there is a 1-up one, one live stream. I'm going to try and backflip straight into this. Which worked out just fine. Which is good. It's M&M's. <laughs> if I don't do this in time, I'm going to have to make a cut. An abrupt cut and just end off the video there I guess what I didn't know you had fire shooting out the bottom of your cannon hey dude that's cheating and I'm dead <laughs> well actually yeah I will make a cut right here um, because the video is only 15 minutes uh, worth of recording so I'm going to make a cut <laughs> and I'm going to resume the recording and fight this boss so I'll see you all then Okay guys, I'm back. Right, where's my Wii remote? Oh right, here it is. <laughs> okay, so I am still on the same recording. This is just a cut that I made, and we are now going to fight this boss and defeat it. Because uh, last time, when I, well, when I was doing it in the last cut, I was failing, and I died, and I had to end off the video because I was recording for 15 minutes, and when I got reached this boss, it was 15 minutes, so I want to just Instead of starting a new video and then having to upload this in a separate video, I don't want to do that, so I'm going to make this all one video, so then it's nicely done, 
and it's all done in just one video, which is what I want. And yeah. Alright, so hang on a second. I haven't even hit this guy yet. <laughs> and now we have, we've done something. We've done some damage. So that's good, that's exactly what I want to see. Him writhing in agony. Right now this boss can be kind of annoying, but once you get the hang of it, it's really not that hard. But like I say, the spring controls are the worst part about this boss. But I think he's dead. Yeah, he's dead. <laughs> the glowing indicates so. Saying that he's about to self-destruct. And we still have those guys to take care of. Well, I ain't bothering those. Th we're bothering with those things. Yeah, they can go screw off. And so can this fly, because that's the thing that distracted me. <laughs> Get out of here. And that's 46 power stars, so we're almost halfway through the game now. Almost halfway through getting 120 power stars, which is good. Alright, so anyway guys, I'm going to end off the video here and continue on in the next episode. So in the next episode of Let's Play Super Mario Galaxy, we shall be either doing Seaside or Gold Leaf. Now, I don't know which one between the two I would rather do most, so it'll, it'll be totally random, total random decision of which one we start next. So anyway guys, until then, uh, this is NDM saying thanks for watching, see you on my next video, and goodbye.